Hi guys and welcome to Hamad's YouTube channel. Today we're gonna review my electricity bill after mining bitcoins for 24 seven for 60 days straight. And we're gonna see how much it's gonna cost, uh, how much I paid before and ex you know, expected expenses to running a Bitcoin machine. So we're gonna check it out. Also before I wanna thank you guys so much for liking and subscribing to my channel. I really, really appreciate it. it gives me motivation to keep making more videos. If you wanna see the Antminer R4 setup, I actually added the link below. So uh, we actually unboxed it and then did the setup from scratch. So if you wanna learn about how mining Bitcoins you can see an example of how to do it from scratch. So let's go ahead and take a look at the electricity bill. Okay, let's take a look at my electricity bill. So as you can see, this is 60 days. This is um, including my regular house electricity that I did and then also the ant miner together. So we spent 1,817 kilowatts, as you can see here, much more than the standard, uh, I would say, 700 kilowatt that I use. So you can definitely see a difference. And I noticed also that there's another tier now. So there's tier one for up to a thousand kilowatt, and there's tier two for anything above. So as you can see, tier one is about 15 cents per kilowatt um, kilowatt hour, and then tier two it's actually um, more. It's actually 18 to 19 cents per kilowatt hour. So you actually pay a lot more for that second tier. So uh, you have to take that into consideration to check which tier you are on and try to keep it in the tier one. As you can see, I usually pay probably 130, uh, 140 total. And then now because of the electricity, because of the extra, the ant miner are for running 24 seven, I actually spent about another, I would say 1,100 kilowatts extra. So that's come up to $150 more, plus a little bit from here. So maybe about $170 extra per month for the electricity bill. And that's for 60 days right here. So as you can see, it's actually can be very expensive running a Bitcoin machine, mining Bitcoins 24 seven. I mean, I spent um, about $170 extra. So I usually pay like 130, 150. Now I pay 330 bucks every two months. So it's very, very expensive. You really have to calculate. Also make sure between the tier one, tier two, it's a big difference, you know? So you have to make sure which tier you are, which tier you're gonna be if you're mining a Bitcoin machine. And also how much you pay for electricity for, you know, in your area. If you pay like six cents or eight cents per kilowatt, it's really, you know, you can take advantage of mining Bitcoins and you're a little bit ahead of the game. So thank you so much guys for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe. I always post new videos about technology, about Bitcoin, about computer stuff like that. So see you guys soon. Bye bye.